PCX League. This match between Timo on the left and Duke of Hobbies on the right. Timo. Ooh. A little too dramatic. Timo flying Kylo, Von Reg, Scorch, and an Epsilon Squadron Cadet. On the other side, Duke with Luke. Duke with Luke. That's cute. With three Red Squadron veterans. Uh, Luke's got Proton Torpedoes. See Timo rocking the uh, the Wayfinders scheme that I painted up for Maui. Beautiful white TIE FOs, BAs, and silencers. I will take a second to appreciate them. Love this color scheme. White ties are just very striking, and they show up really well against dark mats. So we've got Opix Kylo, Daredevil Von Reg, Naked Scorch. Sending Kylo down the bottom of the board. Going for that flank. Epsilon Cadet up here, Chitin. He's got a 5 forward, right? Yeah, so he'll probably end up running. You don't want to joust that. Ugh. Yoda in the chat with the dad jokes. Those aren't tie strikers. How can they be striking? Banned. tight uh, grouping of obstacles here does not lend itself to formation flying but it looks like Duke's got a nice screen of generic X-Wings gonna keep his valuable Luke Skywalker behind Epsilon Squadron Cadet with a three bank barrel roll Keeping his options open, could turn in, could run away. Yep, so just a little advancement here, two forward from the T-65, stay in formation, take focuses. One forward from Luke. Keep some space there. Kylo with the early turn in three hard. Maybe a barrel roll. Okay. Barrel rolls to the right and boosts. He says, I'm not committing to nothing. He is stressed to the one hard. Not really an option. Next turn. Von Reg with a one bank barrel roll. Staying at range for now. Back to dials. Are we going to see some committing to lanes here from the 265s? Too hard, maybe, into here. Bank into this lane. Scorch has to figure out which way he wants to go around this gas cloud. First five minutes coming to an end. Rebels have pretty much stayed in this corner. Timo's done a lot of positioning. Let's take a look at the silencer dial. Oh boy. 
<laughs> Look at all those straight blues. But I would imagine Kylo wants to two have the option of barrel rolling back if I don't know what could happen. I mean, mainly Luke. Three bank out of the Epsilon, takes a focus. Too hard, out of the yellow T65, yep. Here comes the column. Scorch turns left, looking for a barrel roll. Backwards puts you on the gas cloud, so go straight. We'll have the option to turn in next turn. Was that the two? Three, okay. So Luke does have range, or has the arc pointing in the right direction. I don't think he has range yet. Takes a focus and boosts in. All right. Kylo, looking to take some shots. Range three into Luke. Von Reg, two straight. Rookie, I, I literally said, I, I saw you say that your prizes for April were an 8-bit fin, and I was like, ooh, show me that. I, it's my card. I made it. <laughs> I was thinking um, resistance fin, and I was like, oh, no, somebody else is doing it. I should find out what those look like. <laughs> it's fin Rao. I made the card. Okay. Back to this match. Uh, let's... Let's roll on the board with the ships. All right. Blank, blank focus. Spins a force point on loop. Why not? Single evade. So I guess Duke's got initiative. Player one. Kylo, much better luck. Spins the focus for three hits. Luke gets his force point back because he's targeted. Ooh, and he's taking a damage. So the gamble from Kylo pays off. Nothing for Scorch. Tron asking if I sold my turnips yet. I sure did. I sold them for 498 apiece. Looks like nothing for the Epsilon, nothing for the T65. So back to dials. Alright, Luke getting a force point back. Yeah, chat saying there's not a lot of options for Kylo. Definitely the worst place to be as an ace is in the corner. 
lose a lot of your options. We'll see if Duke tries to get out here and block Kylo. Cupcake says you can't turn your back on the rest. I mean, you got to turn your back on somebody. Go after Kylo. Come down here to go after Von Reg and turn your back on Kylo. I mean, who's worth the most points? Kylo's at 80, so that could be a consideration. But Kylo could just, I don't know, five forward. And it's probably a little too much for. Too hard barrel roll. Too hard one bank. I mean, you need a, a lot of coverage here. So the three banks are not blue, so bank or move fast. Epsilon moving up with a four. Looking to get in the fight. Three four from yellow. All right, looking to go after Von Reg. It looks like Green Banks in. So does Orange. Scorch moves up, takes a focus. We'll see. I mean, maybe this is big brain time. Um, maybe Duke thinks Timo knows that he wants to go after, wants to send uh, the X-Wings after Kylo. So let Kylo flail around. Oh, doesn't get the block, though. Two bank left from Kylo, and he's got a range one shot right into the rear of Luke. Let's see, did Luke roll backwards? Yeah, he, he tried. I like the idea of that barrel roll, but let's see how much room is between them. It's a little bit. Von Reg gonna take a deplete to barrel roll. Takes a focus. All right. He's going to start us off here. He is depleted, so it'll be three dice at range one. Uh, one hit. Ooh. Spins the focus because he's got nothing to shoot at. 
Takes no damage. Luck's out there on yellow. Luke. Yeah, do you shoot into the cheapest ship in the first order right now? Epsilon Squadron Cadet. 25 points in total. 13 for half. Would be nice to... Ooh! Rolls them natties, though. Takes one on the Epsilon. Shield down. Kylo. Range one into Luke. 4v2. Spin that lock on the blank. Oh, he's got... He didn't take a lock. He took a focus because he has optics. Hey! Natty's out of Luke and only takes one. Still above half. And some big breaks here for Duke. Scorch still has a shot. Taking a stress. Takes the stress. Ooh, still rolling fire. Hit, hit, crit. Oh, that evade wanted to turn. Adjust the gravity in this room, please. Two shields on green. Oh, you know what? I never labeled these guys. Got yellow. Green. And orange. Green lost two shields. X-Wing's going to start shooting two hits. I assume into the Epsilon. Oh, a blank out! Takes two. So much luck here for Duke. Here's a range one shot from Green. Four paint. Means uh, Timo's down a ship. Doesn't get so lucky on that roll. Hit crit. Two evades. Timo gets to keep his Epsilon. And he's in a great blocking position. Still gets to shoot as well and has his focus. Here's a 3v2 on green. One damage will be half points. Hit crit. Can he get all paint? He's still got his focus. Two gets it. Focus for two evades. Very, very fortunate round for Duke there. Gets caught out of position. Takes two shields on green. One shield on Luke. Nothing into yellow from this range one shot. Just a tickle on Luke. Very, very fortunate there. Oh, yeah. I think Greg talking about strain here from the bullseye of uh, Von Reg. So I wouldn't be surprised to see Epsilon move up with a three or a four. Get in the way of Luke. I wonder if Luke banks towards Scorch. Scorch shouldn't be too difficult to block. One forward. Maybe a two out of orange. Block those two banks, two forward. Let's 
take a look at the T65. It's a three talon, right? Yeah. Hmm. That's no good. So Duke actually first on the board, 13 points for half of Epsilon. He's one hit away from half on Luke and the green T T65. Hasn't lost him yet. Yep, there's the bullseye. Gives him a strain. Let's get him mixed up. Deplete. Could affect the proton torp. Hey, nice little K turn there from the Epsilon. Might get the block and shots. Green moves up and takes a lock, feeling pretty confident. Puts it on the Scorch, gonna prepare for a future turn. Orange, interesting position. Don't think it blocks much of what Scorch would do. Takes a focus. But not leaving a lot of room for Von Reg. Ooh, can he adjust it? Which way did he? He went backward. Yeah, rolling forward wouldn't help him. Takes the damage on yellow. Yeah, Scorch. Just two forward could barrel roll if you want to get out of orange's arc yep there it is luke banks in The three bank takes a lock. Kylo hard turns in. Oh man, are we going to see a one bank daredevil? There's the focus boost from Kylo. One hard turn from Von Reg. Oh, he may turn towards yellow here. I don't think he gets a shot if he turns the other direction. Yep, moving tokens out of the way. He's thinking about it. Could go for a strain lock daredevil boost, maybe. There's the lock. Yep, 
Yep. There's the hard turn. Ooh. Von Red gonna start us off. 4v2. Oh, nothing of use in that roll. Double blanks, double eyeballs. Gonna spin the target lock. Looks like two hits. Watch this yellow natty out. Very close. Takes a shield, does not give up half points. I think Luke is next. Arrange one into Scorch. Oh, he's depleted though. Gonna be three. Hit crit spins the lock on the blank. For hit hit crit. Blanks out on Scorch! That's the second tie to blank out. Fuel leak, half points on Scorch. Kylo, looking for some vengeance. Range one, into Luke. Spins his focus for four, two dice from Luke. Takes three, that's half points. Luke on one, and is range one of Scorch. Oh, there was a crit in there, and that's another fuel leak. Not gonna matter with one hole left. Takes the stress for four dice. No mods on Scorch. One hit. Luke can easily make it out of this. Oh, oh no! He blanks out, takes the damage. Goodbye, Luke Skywalker. You never got to fire a proton torpedo. At least the blanks are uh, evening out here. I think we all need to go subscribe to Nickel City X-Wing so we can use those uh, blank emotes. They're a hot commodity these days. Orange. Three dice into Von Reg. Three hits. Two evades, takes one. Epsilon Squadron into orange. Three dice, no mods. One hit. Takes it. Shield down on orange. Wow, what a round there. Blanks on Scorch. Gives up half points down to one. Blanks on Luke. Leads to his demise. Talon roll onto the rock means yellow doesn't have any shots. Might have been able to finish. Scorch off. What are we looking at? 75 to 30. Yellow and green, shieldless. Orange still has one. One shield off of Von Reg. All right.
three forward from Epsilon relieves the stress. Might be worth taking an evade. close on orange there. Takes a focus, green turns around. Uh What did Epsilon did Epsilon barrel rolled and made room for these X-wings? Gonna roll for the gas cloud, takes the strain. hard out of Scorch is not running. out of there. Make some room for Kylo, who bumps into the back of Orange here. does have range does have the ability to uh, daredevil if he wants it could take a target lock and then regular boost and shoot into green this is the only shot he's got to worry about taking the deplete Goes for a lock on orange. And goes for an evade. He's not taking any chances. What is this place? Kylo. Hold on. Check Von Reg for green. Uh, hit crit. Yellow, taking hit crit. Looks like a panicked. Double stress. Two hits. This is from Scorch. Two Natty evades. Hey yo. You gonna take this ship off the board? Yep, we're gonna try and kill the Epsilon here. Four dice, range one. Oof. Spins the focus for two. Can Epsilon natty out? Needs two evades. Gets one! Takes one. There's a ship off the board. 
It is the cheapest one, but it's gone. 96 to 42. Yellow might be able to take a shot into Scorch. Did yellow already shoot? Uh, green going to take a shot here into Kylo. No mods. Kylo's down a force point. Hit crit. One evade takes one. Looks like it's obstructed to Scorch, but it'd be three dice, 3v4. Yeah, I think I'd take that chance. Focus for two. Hey, two natural evades. Back to dials. 37 minutes left, 96 to 42. Duke needs 55 to take the lead. Vondrag took some time off. Stayed safe. But I think it's time to one hard in and get some shots. I believe that's double stress. Yeah. From Panic Pilot on yellow. Force point, there it is. Green moves up, relieves the strain and the stress. Ooh. Yellow smashes into his friend, does not relieve the stress. Scorch moves up, removes the stress. Doesn't look like he's going to get a shot. Nowhere to barrel roll there. Takes an evade. Green does have him in arc. Ooh, the K turn. Puts Kylo right in front of Orange. There's the one hard from Von Reg. Von Reg, range one, focus target lock. He already had the target lock, so didn't have to take a strain or a deplete. Rerolls, spins the focus for two hits and two crits. Spins the focus. Takes hit, crit, crit. Looks like a direct hit into a console fire. So could die at his engagement if Kylo doesn't do it for him. Here's 
Mars range one. Spins a force point for three, and that is a guaranteed kill on orange. 137 to 42. Whose lock is this? Veteran number two. So that is green has this lock back here on Scorch. Spins the focus for three. Evades one, takes one, Scorch. Is gone, 137 to 58. And now you just gotta deal with the aces. Unknown's in here. He's uh, in the Cover Cup match coming up next. Yellow is stressed, so probably not getting that arc on the target. Might be worth two banking towards the gas cloud. Taking a lock. Ooh, Von Reg. With the bullseye on green, voted most likely to talon roll next turn. Yep, there's that Talon. Very talented, that one. Uh, two bank. Relieves the stress. One of them. Oh, yeah, that was the Panic Pilot. Might be able to just boost right out of that arc. Doesn't care. Uh, turns Von Reg in. Green's got four left. Strain target lock. Takes a focus. Wow, strains himself. Okay. If he doesn't kill Green and Green throws 4v2. Spins the lock. And the focus. Now he has no defensive bonds. Green has four hole left. You can't even kill him with that. Is he strained? Yeah. Takes two. And now Green gets a range one shot back against Von Reg, who's got two dice, three hit points. Yeah, here's a 4v2. Oh, very lucky there. For Timo. One hit. Takes it. That's half points on Von Reg, but man, he's... That was a big chance. 88 to 158. I think Timo didn't think there was enough drama here. Yellow still stressed, so not... Able to K turn or Talon. And I imagine Kyla will be there to take advantage of that. Now, green is stressed. Could two bank maybe open those foils up? I don't even think a boost would block the one hard turn.
28 minutes left, 88 to 158. Nuke needs 71. Just kill all of Kylo. No big deal. There's the two bank. Relieves the stress. Goes for a barrel roll. Not bad. Two bank from green as well. Could go for a barrel roll to try and block a one hard turn. That's not a bad idea. if you don't block it, you can one hard turn, barrel roll, daredevil. There it is. I like that. Going for a barrel roll boost. Might end up with some arc there. Oh! Ho, ho, ho! Von Reg does not get caught sleeping. With the sloop! 4v2 in the green. Man, that's how close that was. Wow. Can green get lucky again? Ooh, yep. Oh! Does green have a shot into Von Reich? Oh, I don't think so. I think it goes right by the base. Ah, oh, bummer. Nothing for Kylo. Very, very lucky for green. Inclination here with yellow is too, too hard. Maybe barrel roll, let Kylo move past you or bump. I mean, you're losing and there's 25 minutes left, so maybe you just go all aggression and 4K. I mean, he's, he's going to arc dodge you all day. Talon roll forward. hard and a focus Kylo moves right through the X-wing Nice bump there from Von Reg. Still gets a shot. Range three unobstructed. One 
One hit, one evade. Range three into Kylo. 3v4. Give Kylo back his force point. Two hits. Three evades. Under 22. Uh, what you looking for there? I would, I'd be tempted to talent roll yellow, because you don't know whether Von Reg's going straight or a hard turn. Green banks in, gets rid of the strain, takes a focus. There's the talent roll on yellow. Did he go backwards? Adjusted forward. You, you definitely want to pull that arc as far backwards as possible. Ooh, talent roll of his own. And Kylo. See two shots into green, who's two haul away from death. Three hits. Spins the lock on the blank. One's going through. Let's see, if there's a blank in here, he's dead. There it is, takes two. Kylo, range three into yellow, who's also got two left, spins the lock, and a force point for three. If there is a blank, let's see, he needs two natural evades to live. That's it, GG! All right. Well, congratulations to Timo. Wins the TCX League. And flying these uh, Maui hexiled colors as well. So big shout out to him. Thanks to everybody for watching. I'll do it for this next, uh, uh, oh boy, this match. Until next time, this is Scott from Exiled Gaming signing off.